I love when they break his. I broke his windpipe. What are you, a doctor now? He's like, <laughs> you're killing the guy. Is that guy dead? By the way, the Russian. No, he's not. In a scene that got cut, they when they go to bring more money to Slava, he's sitting there at the table with part of his head missing. And he he's like, you know, from missing a part of his head. And so Slava. He can't talk. <laughs> what but, does Slava say? Oh, nothing. crazy what happened to him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something like that. But they say what happens. And then they all lock eyes. And Paulie and Christopher lock eyes at him. And they, they say, you can tell that he remembers, but he just can't say. Or even, you know what I mean? It was a scene that got but cut. But it was a cut, scene, a cut scene. So we don't know. So you don't know. But yeah, he's alive. Who took the, who stole Paulie's car and the money? He did. Yeah. What was he, an interior decorator? Yeah, his house looked like shit. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of the greatest. He killed 16 Czechoslovakians. <laughs> he killed like 16 fucking Czechoslovakians. Really, he killed 16 Chechen rebels. <laughs> oh my God. He's with the Interior Ministry. <laughs> <laughs> what was it? A universal remote? Put remote yeah. back on table. Before you came here, you wiped your ass bare hand. <laughs> <laughs> Place remote back on docking down station. On docking <laughs> station. Oops. <Yeah. laughs> I just love how nonchalant. I love when they break his. I broke his windpipe. What are you a doctor now? He's like, You're killing the guy. I think I broke his windpipe. He says. <laughs> what are you a doctor now? <laughs> but like you see all these guys, and you know this happens. They get in a situation like that. They think they kill a guy. In this case, normally they actually did, but they didn't. Yeah. And. They're like, find the nearest rug. <laughs> Let's roll his, own, his own rug. <laughs> Let's roll him up and put him in the truck. Yeah. Like, could you imagine driving a car a mile with a body in the trunk? Minus, like, just going and then, down and you the turnpike. want to stop at Roy Rogers. Yeah, with a body go, in the trunk. Yeah, well, let's get a burger. Yeah. We'll go bury, we'll go we'll bury him in the barrens. We'll, we'll go to AC. We'll make a day out of this. Oh, my God. I can't not think about it. Every time I drive through the Pine Barrens, I'm just like... There it is. We'll get our joints copped. <laughs> <laughs> That's a line that should have never died. No. Why do people not say that? Because he has so many, there's so many one-liners, so. One yeah, but like people don't say that. As, we'll get our joints yeah, comped. Yeah, talking about blowjobs. Yeah. They're not. <laughs> we'll get our joints comped. <laughs> it was, it was, it was Richie April the first time going, oh, she comped my joint. Yeah. Yeah. Whose joint you comp when he gave her the money? Whose joint you comp? Yeah. They wanted him to be Tony. He, he uh, actually tried out. Not tried out, but... Oh, that wouldn't have worked. No, exactly. That yeah. wouldn't have worked. And did yeah. you know Big Pussy used to own, like, uh, bars back in the day? New Rochelle. Yeah. And Moltisanti used to go there mm -hmm. at 18. He would let underage people in drinking. These Italians, they all know each other, man. They all, they they all, all know each other. They all are networked. Yeah. They know what's going... It's, it's amazing, but they, they really do. Yeah. They know who knows who.